You are there ladies and gents, how's it going? We are back out with the TRF again this week. Uh, this one is another ride I am leading. I'm on my Beta 390RR. Uh, a smaller group today because some people haven't turned up. Um, again, it's a novice day, uh, but yeah, TRF ride uh, around the Surrey lanes. It should be really good fun, a nice variety of people. Um, Pez is going to be tailing Charlie. He was going to be coming on his little CT, um, but that's not very good in the mud. Um, so yeah, he's on his Certeo, but everyone else is on little bikes. Awesome stuff. Should be brilliant fun. Keep that bike from down. Right then, we are out on the first lane. Um, yeah, it's going to be an interesting day. Uh, different pace from normal um, because this is actually a novice ride. A lot of the riders here have got a bit more experience than that. Um, but yeah, we, we're treating this one as a full on novice ride. Uh, we'll not be doing any technical lanes as such. Um, but we will still go through that soggy one that we went through on the adventure bikes last week. All right, let's see what this one's like then, see if it's drained out any. <laughs> the water here on the right hand side is very deep. Okay. The left hand side isn't too bad, um, but you can go up and around. Um, there's a there's a little track just on this on the left hand side where you can you're going to the left one okay okay let's go wait for Pez to get here I don't know I'm gonna go back and see if I can find him I'll be back in a minute yeah yeah but if he's broken down Sorry, mate. Oh, back to moving. Keep, 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 keep. There we go. A bit more. You got it? Yeah, yeah. It's horrible when it's sliding, isn't it? <laughs> Hey Sylvie. Awesome, well done Gil. Pez is following me through. <laughs> well done! Man, this bike is an animal. It eats all this up so much easier than the Aprilia. <laughs> awesome fun. Although the ride's the same length today because it's pretty much the same course, minus one of the tougher lanes. Um, it's probably going to be a shorter video. Just because I want to enjoy the ride. It's a fun lane, that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. That's why I quite like to start on that one. Yeah. I mean, it's the toughest one we're going to be doing all day. Um, but yeah, but it, it just gets the blood flowing a bit, doesn't it? When we got to the end of that last lane, we just had a, a little regroup, make sure everyone was okay, and uh, had some fluids and all that sort of stuff. And now we're cracking on again. This isn't too deep here. Um, <laughs> well done. I stand on the clutch. Yeah, that's exactly it. Keep the revs up and slip the clutch, and you get through anything. Thank you, training. <laughs> Lots of, lots of soggy puddles still, but they have all drained right off now. So nothing quite as scary as it was on the big bikes. Did it the wrong way around. We should have done the little bikes that weekend and the big bikes this weekend would have been a bit easier. It's really cool doing this novice ride type thing. Um, it, no pressure, just ride your own pace. Just have some fun, 
Is that a bike or a mower bike? Looks like it's a motorbike, but it could be a bicycle. It's a bicycle with just a very good headlight. Oh yeah, feeling alive, feeling alive. Well, that tree wasn't fallen last time we come along here. Guess there's some rotten roots out there. With the ground being so wet, it's uh, able to fall out, fall out of the ground. It's so much easier now than it used to be, isn't it? Did, did you try that one before they graded it? Just before they graded it. Yeah, all chalk, wet chalk, it's just... I, did, I think we did that when I did the off the curb day. Right. I think it was like that then. Right, yep. I mean, there, there is another one which is still slippery as hell chalk and it goes up the same hill, it just does it a bit further along. What we did with rats? No, that's London Lane. Yeah, that's London Lane, yeah, yeah. yeah. Lane, yeah. We're literally, we There's had no traction. in front of you and it's wet. Yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. Going, what's going on? <laughs> and you still can't. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> it is so, so pretty through here now. I know a lot of people think Wolvens has been ruined by being graded but it's still an absolute pleasure to ride along. Rides don't have to all be just technical stuff. It's just nice getting some wind in the hair. And motorboy therapy. Proper, proper pretty. Proper, proper pucker. Awesome stuff. It's quite a few trees down, it seems. I guess we've had a bit stronger wind than I realized. It's mad. That's uh, one of the reasons. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's one of the reasons I normally do midweek rides when I'm riding for myself. Um, you get a lot less dog walkers. I'm, I'm surprised we haven't seen any horses yet. There's been some. There's been some horse poo down on the tracks, so the horses have been out. Um, but we might come into some. Ah! Caught that on camera as well, mate. <laughs> you on, James? You meet the nicest people in the countryside. <laughs> Been trail riding with uh, that lad with the uh, dog there a few times. Uh, even went down to Dartmouth camping. Not Dartmouth, Dartmoor. <laughs> Small world. This is such a fun climb. Such a fun climb. being very talky today at all so I hope this video is uh, not too boring for you um, yeah I'm just just really enjoying riding really enjoying the riding now oh, the leaves are covering up all the evilness <laughs> awesome! <laughs> Brilliant! We are just so, so very lucky to have access to all this, which is why I like doing it as responsibly as I can. Um, yeah, it'd be a shame to lose it, if you know what I mean, and to lose it for being an idiot. 
Yeah, to lose it for being an idiot, inconsiderate to the other users and all that. Well, that's just a, an own goal, isn't it? Uh, he's found someone else to talk to. <laughs> a short hill this bit but it's fun 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 all right let's see what the water's like today not too bad at all the flow's really died down as well awesome I'm to stand in a puddle. Splish. It's not too bad. It's a bit deeper there. But it's not too deep here. It's about a foot deep there though. Here they come. It was a good climb. Hot arm. Oh, I like that. Good. Yeah. The first time I've ever come down it. Oh, is it? Yeah, I've always, always gone up. Yep. It's, it's so steep, isn't it? That's got a totally different trail. Yeah, we went. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's so different. Yeah. Coming down. So different. So different. Your bike okay? Yeah, it just stalled and then I flooded it. Oh, don't. <laughs> you alright, James? How you doing, mate? How's tricks? Yeah, I'm good. I only saw you come past the first time. Yeah, I didn't recognise you straight away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you alright? Are you okay? Are you okay, mate? Yeah, fine. You sure? Yeah. Good. Are you able to get the bike off me? Sorry about that. No, it's fine. It's fine. Oh. Are you okay? Right. Yep. Yeah. Get out of that oh. You're right. oh. It's uh, uh, is that your alarm? Yeah. Are you okay? You're right, buddy. Yes, I think so. You sure? Yeah. My alarm bleeding. No, don't, don't at all. Don't, don't feel guilty at all. <sighs> you alright? Did you just go into the back of me? Yeah. You winded? Are you hurt? No, just a little bit. Oh, yeah, I? yeah. Oh. Stick your stand down. Just, uh, we'll chill out for a little bit. Well that shows how easy it can all go a little bit wrong. We've always got to be mindful that we're going to come across an animal, be it a horse, a dog, a person, bicyclist, all different animals aren't they? Um, but yeah, yeah. So uh, if you're in a group, give yourself a little bit of room. Thankfully the chap is okay, a bit winded. But no major injuries, plastics on my bikes, these sort of bikes are pretty cheap so uh, it shouldn't cost him too much to get his bike fixed and we'll be able to MacGyver it together so it can last the rest of the ride. Ah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm just glad he's alright. I'd feel very guilty if um, someone got hurt on a ride I was leading. There's just the three of us now, me, Sylvie and Pez. Um, 
Yeah, Ed was only here for uh, the half day anyway, and uh, I think Richard made the wise choice about calling it quits because his headlight is in a bit of a state on his bike now after after going into the back of me. So um, yeah, I think it was the right thing for him to do. I don't think he's hurt himself, which is good to hear. Hopefully I'll uh, find out later on that he's got home okay and all that sort of stuff. Um, yeah, it's always something that is on the back of your mind if someone has an incident while you're, you're out on a run. And uh, there's, you can't help but feel slightly guilty about it when it happens. Um, but we ride our own rides. Well done, Sylvie. Yeah, it's just one of them things. I haven't actually got a huge amount left of the battery in this camera at the moment. Um, and I'm not sure if uh, we're going to have a chance to stop and change batteries. Well, I'm not really that bothered either, whether I do or don't. Um, so we have what we have. It's really cool having Sylvie along with us on her little Alp. I have such fond memories of mine. Hers is the 200. Um, but a cracking bike nonetheless and uh, uh, brilliant to see it being used properly out on the trails. Um, I mean, I don't know anyone that would have one or not, but yeah, yeah. And it's such a, a, a user-friendly motorcycle. It hasn't got a mega high seat, although it's still not, not low low. It's not, not like road bike low. Um, but yeah, yeah, just such a user-friendly motorcycle. Oh, I have a lot of fondness for them. I love it. Seeing the roost of leaves coming up behind the bike. It's really cool, uh, just a, a nice effect. Um, yeah, I love this time of year, I really do. This is actually a road, this one. It's not a green lane, it's a road. Um, but it is a very cool one. <laughs> A TRO. I wonder if that's them trying to close this and turn it into a footpath or a cycleway or a bridleway or something. I hope not. I've absolutely loved coming out on these uh, TRF rides. It's been awesome meeting some new people, getting some new friends and stuff like that, and getting to ride trail bikes. Brilliant. What more could you want? <laughs> anyway, if you've liked what we've been up to here and think you'd quite fancy having a go at that yourself and you've got a bike but you just don't have people to ride with or uh, um, an understanding just yet of uh, where you're able to legally, um, yeah, do check out the TRF. They're a very friendly bunch, especially the London and uh, Surrey chapter. I think it's like 55 quid for the year to join and that gets you access to the TRF themselves for guided rides and also access to, um, I think we must have a horse coming up, and also access to uh, the Green Road Map which is an awesome resource which shows you all the legal green lanes and stuff around the country. Anyways, we're in a bit of a traffic jam now because we've caught up with some other people doing some trail riding. So uh, yeah, join the TRF if this is something you want to have a go at. Subscribe to this channel if this is something that you like watching videos on. And uh, yeah, you ride safe, take care, and we shall catch you all on the next one. Have a bye for now. <laughs> Cheers chaps! Thank you. Cheers. Keep Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Have a nice day. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers, mate.